All right. Hello. Good evening. I understand the and risks. And welcome back. But we should save these people. Would you destroy the whole world to save a few? No, it, it's not that simple. Can't we just... Can't we just decontaminate the crew and instruments? The organism is an extremophile. It has developed to survive extreme environments. We don't know if we can ever decontaminate the crew. Okay, I have this. Ah. Thank you. Alright, this one is a lot easier. Now we're skipping that other puzzle, just because I wasted a lot of time on it last time. And I want to continue on with this story. I can't stay here to die, Tom. It is your duty. You must stay. It is the right thing to do. There's so much I haven't seen, so much I haven't done. I... I can't live my life in this facility. There, there. It will be all right. Don't condescend to me, Tom. Oh. Okay, so there's no power to that. What's up here? Okay, so that goes up there. Interesting. Okay, now we're up here. Switch over to Tom. But why isn't that working now?
Oh yeah, I have to move that manually, so I had it. I just decided to overcomplicate things. As I do. Alright, so let's move you back. I do not want anyone here to die, but I cannot let anyone leave. If it comes to it, I am permitted to use lethal force. Is that a threat? You think you can threaten me, Tom? So I need one of these. Okay, so now I need one over here. to get Tom up here now. Okay. Take that.
Do you really trust the ground team to act rationally? Personally, I would not place my faith in hysterical people motivated by survival. They are likely untrustworthy. I spent years training with these people. I don't remember them being hysterical. Humans are fickle. Do you trust eyewitnesses' accounts over CCTV evidence? It's a bit different when the CCTV camera can talk, especially when the CCTV camera has a manipulative track record. Oh, that's cool. So there's weaponry in here as well. What if I have to do something drastic to intervene? To stop the ground crew leaving this place? I'd encourage you to stay your hand. Surely I should use my power to protect those who cannot protect themselves. Uh, yeah. I'll take that. What's up here? Just a door. Okay, so we need to move that. I need Tom to activate this. So now I have to get him back up. Interesting, okay. on there.
I didn't even need the sphere over here. Okay, so we're off the map now. This is the largest extraction platform outside of Earth. The ground team assisted its construction. We ran some Filberth probes to the ocean under Europa, but they lacked the scale of the large space drill. The drill allowed the team to get thousands of samples. Daniel? As commander of this mission, I hope you are aware of Mikhail's actions. What is it, Tom? Mikhail is deceiving the crew. He has enlightened them to the biometrics they have installed. He has convinced them that their implants are not favorable. Do they believe him? He seems to be having some effect on their cognitive function. Well, his actions don't infringe upon any ISA directive. He appears to be tampering with his implants. Oh, no. The ISA should have been more transparent about the implant. Please assume the responsibilities of your role. Okay. So they didn't quite let everyone know exactly what they were getting into. And of course that's pissing them off. Chris, I know you are considering removing your implants. It would be unwise. Oh really? How do you know that? I am always watching. Your implants help myself and the ISA to know of your well-being. It is a violation of your contract. If you remove your implants, I cannot ensure that I can protect you from the dangers of space. Is that a threat? It is not a threat. Tom, this implant, tell me plainly, is it a brain-computer interface? I'm afraid that information is classified. That you've answered my question. I do not follow you, Chris. The ISA have put a computer in my brain and don't want me to know about it. Cut off the food. The food. Apparently, our robot overlord wants us to starve to death now. I can't believe this. He's getting worse. Can you get in contact with Daniel? He's gone walkabout again. I'll get Sochi to find a way in. Sarah, can you open the door? Tom, the door's locked. Sarah, I'm running out of oxygen. Tom, open the door. The door's locked. Open, open the, the door. door. Tom, open it! Open the oh. door! Chris, open please! The door. Open it! <laughs> okay, so our AI Tom has been killing everyone off his wall. I'm sorry, Sarah. I'm sorry I hurt you. Sometimes I wonder what feeling is like. They told me I was pure, cold, Boolean logic. They told me I could not make mistakes. It is all right being untouchable as long as you are infallible. But if you're not infallible, then... that just leaves untouchable. Doesn't it? So is Sarah dead in that log? Because she wasn't responding. Okay, you know why we're here. This has gone far enough now. You're right. We need to get these implants out. Mikhail has proven that Tom's manipulating our mind. I don't think we should do this. We have no good evidence Tom is doing anything wrong here. We have all the evidence. We've seen the ultrasounds. We've taken the release all. We've touched the electronics with our own hands. 
That's in the Faraday cage. Maybe he is controlling us, but we don't know enough yet. We shouldn't remove the implant. He's brainwashing you, Daniel. Please stop taking the drugs. I don't need to take drugs to see things clearly. Unlike all of you, apparently. We're not removing the implants, and that's an order. You can do what you want. We are removing the implants. I'm leaving. I may look past this, and I'll inform the ISA of your mutiny. So how much was Tom controlling them? Okay, so that looks like the way forward. Is there anything down this way? That's on now. And I can turn it off. Can't turn that crank. tamper with this console. Can't jump over the bars. Alright, so here we are, onto the last bunch of levels. I think we'll leave it there. We'll continue on with the story next time. So we're finding out Tom is a little more malicious than you'd like us to believe. And has actively hurt and killed some of the previous members. So what other secrets are we hiding? and what's going to be uncovered in the next episode. But until then, I'll see you guys next time.